Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome back to my channel. So today I just wanted to give a quick update on a few recent items relating to Paladins and my channel in general. First off, Sony has finally announced and released the ability for PS4 players to change their PSN online IDs. So this can be done either via the PS4 console itself or on the PlayStation website. I just wanted to let you guys know that at first I was very wary and cautious about changing my name, wondering if maybe all my Paladin's progress might be lost. Uh, will I lose my skins? Will I lose my crystals or anything of that sort? I've reached out to the Paladins developers at Evil Mojo and they have been kind enough to provide an answer. So according to their response on Twitter, they have confirmed that everything should run perfectly fine and in fact their team had actually begun internal work on this months ago to ensure that things would go smoothly. So massive thanks to Evil Mojo for that. As an added bonus to confidence, Paladins is also mentioned in the Sony website under the games with no issues with regards to PSN online ID changes. So we can only hope that Sony enable crossplay in the not too distant future as Paladins is apparently also ready to go once they're given the green light. Having said that, I want to let you guys know that I have now changed my PSN ID from CrazyCarl15 to reflect my YouTube channel. So my new PSN online ID is KingCrazyCarl. As always, any subscribers are most welcome to add me and join me on console as we play on a nightly basis. I've also used my account as a guinea pig and I've tested Paladins with my new username. Unfortunately, everything was perfectly fine, everything's smooth sailing, so it had no effect on anything whatsoever on my profile. If you guys wish to change your PSN ID, I've linked the details in the description below. Also, if you have any issues, um, just let Sony know and Sony will give you the option to revert back to your original ID by contacting their customer support team. So moving on, we've also got some news on the Paladins Community Skin Contest which finished just recently. The voting brackets enabled us as the community to select one champion from each class to progress to the next stage. So the champions per class that have been chosen for this year are Leon, Ash, Grover and Talus. So personally I'm overall pretty happy with these results, it's pretty good, um, it's great that most people have chosen to give these champions skins and these champions are much less loved in the Paladins realm, however I still feel bad for Barak, Torvald and Eevee who have yet to receive a skin in such a long time. Although I am an Ash main so I'm pretty excited to finally see her getting some really creative and different skins. The final skins for each of these four will also be um, released in the October patch. So these skins, these champions, sorry, will receive five community concept skins chosen by our submissions starting from this Friday. Um, we will be able to vote on these um, new concept skins for each of the champions and they'll be developed alongside the community through a creation process which will run through until October. Lastly, we have rumors of the Datamine Bunny Ceres skin, which is coming soon in the next patch. Personally, I think she will be released as a secret in the Easter period and similarly to the Valentine skins for Tyra. And um, FYI, she has already made her appearance in one of the amazing concept artworks by Thunderbrush. As you guys know, the artwork in Paladins is also returning back to its form. Um, with the shaded paint style rather than the ugly cartoon artwork that we had over the last year. So Thunderbrush and the art team have been doing a really excellent job in this space and I'm really glad to see this style finally come back. Um, there are also rumors about two new champions going around. Um, you might be able to find some videos around these. So there's one character named Io who's going to be a support healer. And there's also Tigron, who's going to be somewhat related to Maeve, um, similar type of species. So I'll let you guys look into that more. Um, those are all rumors going around the realm. So anyway, let me know what you guys think. Will you guys be changing your PSN ID? And what are your thoughts on the community skins champions that have been selected for this year? Thanks guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time.